It is Vlogmas Day 8, I think. This is Friday. <laughs> so I thought I would catch you up on a few things that's happened this week. It's been really busy. I've been taking pictures uh, of just di different things, but I haven't really had a lot of time to sit down and edit. And I actually sat down yesterday and I edited I, I probably spent an hour editing and adding music and all kinds of things. And then right at the very end, I was just going to add the ending. And then voila, my computer just, the software just crashed. So it's not the first time it's happened. Sometimes when I'm filming on my laptop, that happens. And when I, it doesn't happen often when I'm on my desktop, but my laptop, it does do that. So that's what happened. And I ended up just doing that quick little coffee and chaos video. Uh, but I actually had some other stuff I wanted to add. So it's been a really busy week. It's my birthday week. So we did have a little celebration and my family is, you know, it's just awesome. So they, um, we went out to dinner and then we had a, a my daughter came over and a couple of friends and we uh, had a little birthday cake and they sang happy birthday to me so I do have a my, my daughter will be on camera with me um, I don't like to put people on camera unless they really you know I like to get permission so so uh, I didn't so it's just my, my daughter will be on camera with me and I'm gonna show you guys that clip real quick You put the hat on. It's your birthday. Okay. It's your birthday. Okay. All right. Cheers, Yeah, cheers, Bridges. <laughs> All right, shall we sing? Yeah, do you want to come over here too? Oh, that's all you guys. <laughs> all right. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Vicky. Happy birthday to you. Be my new neighbor. <laughs> Yay. Okay. Come on. You can do it. Yeah, come on. Keep going. Oh, oh you almost got it. Oh, keep going. Hey. <laughs> That's not fair. <laughs> I'll make yourself pass out now. I quit. I'm done. You did good. You did good. You are a trickster. <laughs> that is not fair. You got more than half of them. I don't know what the problem is. Yeah, I know. What What's up with that? Windless. Oh, my goodness. Happy birthday. So, it was really fun. They, they were just... And my daughter, let me show you some... She brought me some flowers. So, yeah. And that, these are so cute because they're, they're sort of in this glass jar... Um, and then it's got the little wicker basket, and this is something I can uh, just keep, you know, it's like a little simple vase, and she or vase, or however you want to say that. I say vase. <laughs> um, but it's something that is so simple, and yet um, she knows me so well, because this is kind of my vibe right now, is just, you know, keeping things kind of simple. So I had 16 boxes of Christmas decor, and I showed that yesterday, I think, and we took them out of I had to get them out of my dining room. I told John I was completely overwhelmed. Um, we were, I knew we were gonna have my birthday and I knew we were gonna have a couple people over for cake, which I got an Oreo ice cream cake from Walmart. It was so good. But anyway, on track here. I was, uh, I knew we were gonna have company over and I, it was just really bugging me that I had all the boxes there. John, because my birthday is the same month as Christmas, one year he threw me a surprise party. It was for my 40th, I think. Completely surprised me. And he, they did, he and the kids and my, my other family, they all got together and they, uh, I, I was, I had no idea what they were going to do. So um, after running errands all day, I walked in the door and there were people all in my house. We probably had 30 people in my, my house that night. And I'm like, oh my gosh, what did you do with all the boxes of Christmas decor that were all over the house? Like, because my house is chaotic the first part of December. I have boxes all over. 
So now ever since then, I get stressed out when I have a whole bunch of Christmas boxes where you walk in the front room, it stresses me out. So anyway, but it was a great party and I, I, it's not that I'm not grateful, I'm very grateful and it was a really fun night, but that was the first thing I thought of when I walked in the door is, oh, where's all the boxes? So anyway, um, so I was stressing out with all those Christmas boxes and I did not have time to go through them all. So we ended up moving them down to the, uh, the, the gym, my workout room, uh, and they're all against the wall, and now I'm just going through them one by one, and it's a, bit, a better pace for me. So today I'm gonna be going through some more. I'm looking, so we have our tree up, and I just bought a little, one of those metal kind of, those skirts that, you know, that you put around your tree, the, I don't know, I, I think it's more for probably real trees. The function of it is probably to keep, to keep, you know, the pets out of the water, like the cats from, and dogs from drinking the water of a real tree, but I think everyone's using them now. Everybody I know, even if they have an artificial tree, is using these little rims. So I went out and found one at Walmart for 15 bucks. I really like it, and we, I put that around the base of my tree, but now I've gotta find the lights to put on my tree so that I can hang the ornaments. And so until I can get, find those lights, I'm stuck, so I have this these ornaments just sitting there waiting to go on the tree. But I am hoping to find those lights today. We went through all those bins uh, the other day and we couldn't find the lights, but we were a little crunched for time. And I told John, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go through them a little more methodically and I know they've gotta be in one of those 16 bins. So that's what I'm gonna work on today. And then um, we did get, so we got that tree base at Walmart for $15. And then I ended up getting, after, remember I was, I went to Sam's Club a, a couple weeks ago and I said, oh, I just cannot buy one of those inflatables. I'm just so afraid that it would just get damaged. But I ended up going to Walmart and for $39, I got this little, it's a four foot inflatable Santa. And I am gonna put this in front of my house. We already have projector, two projectors that project these great lights all along the side of our house. It looks really great. We've gotten so many compliments and I just love the look. And I will eventually um, go, sh I'll show you sometime during Vlogmas, I'll, I'll give you a picture of that. But I'm picking, I'm, I'm trying to find ways to decorate that are, that so that we don't have to climb up on the roof and all of that. It's just a little bit less stress. Uh, just because John is, he's working all through the holidays and it's just busy, it's a busy time. And anyway, so, and I like the projector lights, I really do. And, the, and I like the house lights too, but I think more and more people are using inflatables and the projector lights and I'm, I'm kind of, I'm digging the vibe, you know? <laughs> so uh, anyway, this one looked cute and uh, I'll eventually get this, I think we're gonna work on this this weekend and I'll get a picture of this with the, with the lights. Hopefully, I don't think this lights up. So I said I might buy like a little spotlight for this. I don't know yet, like just a little kind of spotlight. I think we have one too. And I know we have some in our backyard, so maybe we can find one that can light this little Santa up. But it was only, it was $39. Some of those inflatables, like there was one that was seven feet high and was, uh, it was over $100. And I'm not, I'm not gonna do that yet. Uh, I'm gonna wait and see if this actually survives. But we do have other neighbors who are putting their uh, their inflatables up and it's working really well. And I know I was gonna go minimal and I talked about that. You know, I'm gonna kinda go minimal, but I think for Christmas, because I now, uh, I am gonna be hosting a Christmas dinner for, for family on Christmas day. So I am going to be probably doing a little more Christmas decor than I thought I would, but I can't help it, I get excited, you know? So that's what's going on. I thought I'd really quickly show you guys. I do have some more videos coming up of, uh, we, we just been running around and we were, we were out of town yesterday and we're actually going to be going back out of town here for a couple uh, days and um, it's just been a really busy time. So, but I do wanna show you guys the advent calendar. So uh, let me grab that. Well, it's just here behind me. I just put it right here behind me, so I'll just bring you guys over and we'll take a look. And there's Roscoe, and he's doing really well. Um, the t-shirt's on him so he doesn't lick his stitches. They have, they'll come out in a couple weeks, but he, it was just a minor thing. 
He did really well. He hasn't even tried to, it doesn't seem to be bothering him at all. So he's been very active. It's just when I'm recording, he just kind of goes over there. And plus, he doesn't, he doesn't seem to like it when I film him. So here's my window or like my window seat. And I have um, those three little animated stuffed animals. I, I love these things. So I, I have those out right now. And I've put some Christmas pillows here. And um, here's my one of my advent calendars. Oh, I need to hang this somewhere still. I'm still, whoops, I'm still in the midst of um, figuring out where I'm gonna put things. I love this. I think I got this from Amazon one year and it's like the e.l.f. clothesline. So I'm gonna be putting this somewhere. I'm not sure where. And they're just really cute little ornaments. They don't take long at all. They're, they've been kind of fun. Just a quick little advent calendar. Oop. Do you guys remember that book? <laughs> My friend who's reading Harry Potter for the first time, um, she's just right, she just got to that place. So it's really fun to kind of listen to her talk about it when it's brand new to you. You know, like I remember how it was when I, with any story, you know. You know, some of these are popped open too. They shouldn't be. They should not be. No, I guess they should. Okay, those are good. All right. So, whoa. So that's, Alexa, what's the date? Today is Friday, December 8th. Yep, see, it is the 8th. Okay. <laughs> so, see, I am trying to stay on track. What is... Oh, goodness. Where's the numbers? Oh, 6, 7, 8. So I'm actually filming this on the 8th, and that's the whole bottom. The whole bottom, and we've made it all the way. So we'll start up here next week. I'm looking forward to finishing my decor and sharing that with you and I'll be sharing more as we get closer to Christmas uh, about all the things that we're doing and yeah let me know in the comments how you're doing how is the Christmas uh, planning going if if you are celebrating Christmas I hope that you're having a really great season take good care and uh, say hi in the comments I'd love to hear from you do subscribe if you haven't already click the like button that really does help you know like that really does help uh, YouTube to know where to put my videos, <laughs> which are all over the place usually. So thank you for being here. I hope you're doing well. Take care. I'll see you tomorrow.